For this exercise, we are just completing one set to absolute muscle fatigue. And we're gonna perform it with bands instead of weights. Now, I like to have a long loop resistance band like I have here. If you have the type of resistance bands that have the handles on them instead, you can use that too. I just prefer this band because it gives us a little bit more resistance and I feel like the range of motion is a little bit better with these longer loop resistance bands. Now to set up, regardless of what band you have, you're gonna stand on the band, make sure that it's nice and secure underneath your feet. And what we're doing is we're going to focus on keeping constant tension on our muscles throughout this whole exercise. So we are not coming down to full elbow lockout at the bottom position here. We always want those back muscles engaged. So I'm going nice controlled reps about two seconds up and then two seconds back down. Again, coming just shy of full elbow lockout. I'm going to keep this range of motion and keep this tempo until I cannot pull the band up to this position anymore because of muscle fatigue. Instead of ending the set, however, I'm just gonna shorten my range of motion and just pull it up as high as I can. So that'll be about half repetitions. Again, focusing on pulling up at that two seconds and down at that two seconds and not locking out at the bottom. Once my muscles fatigue further and I can no longer pull it up to this mid range, I'm just gonna pull a couple inches from that start position as you see me doing here. I am focusing on controlling, the band's not snapping me back down, and I'm not going to full elbow lockout. And I move that band until I physically cannot lift that band anymore because of muscle fatigue. So that is going to complete one set of our VRT rows.